Today we are finally going to start planting some stuff around the house, trying to make the front yard look a lot better. We've been living here for a year and a half. We haven't done much with the yard. We haven't really had the time or the money. We only have a few plants to put in the ground today. We're going to be putting some trees and some other bushes and things in the future. So this is kind of an ongoing project. Today we're just going to start stripping some grass and starting to figure out where our planter bed or I don't even know what you call this thing but we're trying to create an area in here around the front porch that's just plants, bushes, flowers. I started out with an old flat shovel. The flat shovel did not work good at all. I thought about sharpening the edge of it. I think it would have worked a lot better, but I would have wasted a lot of time trying to sharpen it. I switched to a normal pointed shovel. It worked better because it was sharper, but it did not scrape the wide path like a flat shovel. I thought this was going to be a quick and easy project. It was very labor intensive. This grass is mostly Bermuda grass and a lot of weeds, a lot of crabgrass. We have terrible dirt on our property. It is full of rocks and clumps. Using this shovel is terrible. It is gonna take forever. I just found a hoe and hopefully that's gonna be better. This garden hoe does not work much better. If it was sharper, then it probably would have worked better. It was still very labor intensive. I've been looking at tractors a lot lately. I really need one. I'm too old and tired to be doing all this work by hand. I don't have a lot of free time available. Doing all this work by hand just takes too long. There are a lot of 0% financing offers right now on equipment, but the country is pretty much on lockdown because of the coronavirus. People are getting laid off left and right. It's not really the best time for me to go buy a tractor. I found this old cultivator. It worked great for a minute. It was ripping up the grass until it fell apart. Miss B is going to try to dig a hole while I show off my amazing camera work here. I have placed the canopy pole right in the middle of the shot. This is a Strongheart Purple Hydrangea. We usually get some better dirt or some potting soil to put around a new plant, but I bought some fertilizer or plant food instead. We will mix it up and spray it on everything after we are done. And I'm still working on this miserable scraping up the grass. We're gonna put another plant over here.
I finally got this side done. I think I've got probably two hours on this project already and I am worn out. So now we're gonna plant this other thing right here. Oh, the tag is missing, it's a gardenia. It's gonna go somewhere right here. It's starting to look pretty good over here now. We got two plants in. We're gonna move the bird bath. I've got to get some pine straw to put around this stuff. I think I'm gonna start working on the other side now. I have a whole lot more grass over there that I have to dig up. And I've got grass over here I need to dig up. I think having this shade out here is probably messing up the video. The GoPro that I'm using, it doesn't transition good from dark to light, but I don't care. If you're doing yard work, you gotta have one of these. It's amazing. It's a, in the low 80s right now, but it's very hot out here. It's nice to stand in the shade while I'm working on this project. Sometimes I use this thing when I'm working on a car too. Obviously I don't have a garage right now, but I can park my car under this. I can work on the car when it's raining or when it's hot outside. We got this bird bath. I think we're gonna put it up here between the two plants. done for today it looks a lot better out here I am beat this is so much work trying to scrape this grass out of the ground when all you're using is a hoe and a shovel I wish I had a tractor I've got some more grass to get up over here we got some stuff we're gonna be planting over here got some grass and some stuff to plant over there and this poor plant here, it sat out in the sun a little bit too long, but it should perk up tomorrow, hopefully, when the sun comes out. We got some water on it. Time to clean up everything. And we'll be putting some straw on here. We're gonna figure out what kind of a border we're gonna put around here. We are back out in the yard. It is the next weekend. There's a major difference in the weather last weekend i had the canopy set up out here and we were in the low 80s today i think we're in the mid 50s it's very windy out here but we're going to get started so i'm going to try to get up all this grass right here we got this thing to plant a lantana then i got to get some grass up on the other side we got some bulbs and things we're going to be planting down there 
Uh, what I found out so far from this project is trying to get this grass up, it's very hard work. I've been using the shovel, had pretty good success with the shovel, and also using a hoe. But my back is hurting, my arms are hurting, even a week later. So I'm going to try something different today. I've got my Echo string trimmer. I'm going to need it to clean up the edge of this bed anyway. But I think I'm going to use it, see if we can dig into this and get the grass up with that. That would be great if it works. Using a string trimmer was so much faster. I wish I would have thought about it when I first started this project. I still had to use the shovel and scrape up some grass and some roots, but it was a lot easier with most of the grass out of the way. This is looking really good out here and we are almost ready for some pine straw. I had some more video footage of planting this lantana and then we planted some caladian bulbs on the other side. I have no idea what happened to that video. We are finally going to call this project done for today. I've got two weekends and about $125 in this project. It looks really good now. We have some future plans. We're going to be putting steps over here. We're going to be adding more bushes and trees and whatever plants. We're going to be redoing these front steps, making them a lot nicer. We have a lot of projects and future videos coming up. We are really just trying to get to a project as we can afford it and as we have time to do it. So not sure when we'll be working on this other stuff. The real work is gonna start now in the next month or so when the grass starts growing back up through all this straw. I'll have to be out here all the time pulling weeds and pulling grass. 
made it this far in my video, thanks for watching. 